Hello, welcome in this SAP video tutorial. Today we are going to discuss how and when to close the maintenance order. Okay. Generally, we have we are creating the maintenance order for any maintenance activity on the equipment. Okay. After doing the payment process for the maintenance, that means we have created the notification, create the maintenance order, create the purchase requisition, approval of the purchase requisition, we have created the purchase order. After the approval of the purchase order, we created the service entry sheet, then Miro, then vendor payment. After doing the payment process for the maintenance work, user forget to close the maintenance order. It should be complete and closed in all respect within the same financial year. It's SSA head responsibility to complete plant head responsibility to complete all this activity in each and every manner. Okay. User had to follow the below steps to close the MO. Okay. You need to uh, execute the first close the notification. Okay. Once you close the notification, the status of uh, any notification is no co status. Okay. Click on this icon through IW22. Once you execute the transaction code IW22, fill the notification number, then this icon will appear. We will display these things. Required in date and time, catalog data tab in which you need to fill the object parts and damage code groups. Catalog in the catalog data tab, cause and activity code group malfunction dates, in dates and time and save the notification. The maintenance order technically complete by click on the icon this using IW32. Okay. So <coughs> this is the steps through which you close the notification. This is the steps through which you close the maintenance order. First, you close the notification, then you try to close the maintenance order. Okay. We have opened the maintenance order in IW32. See, this is the uh, uh, black and white flag symbol complete technically. Okay. Once you click on this, the system status of the maintenance order in the release state will go in the takeover stage. Okay. And uh, click on the check button and say the status of the maintenance order will change to take over. This is the check button. Okay. This is the check button. After clicking on this, if there is no error, then you can save the maintenance order. Okay. Actual order settlement in FICO module. Once you uh, maintain the status of uh, your maintenance order in the TECO, technically complete, the accounts team uh, like concerned junior account officer or senior account officer or account officer will do the settlement, will run the settlement using the transaction code KO88. If uh, accounts team want the bulk settlement, then uh, it's Transaction code is KO8G. Okay. And uh, you need to uh, select the maintenance order number, settlement period, posting period means cost period in the FI period, fiscal year. Okay. Processing type is automatic, appearing by default. Execute first with the test run. If there is a no error, go with the actual settlement. Okay. You need to fill the order. This is the settlement period, means 10th month of the financial year. 2018 is the financial year processing type is automatic first you check on this test run execute if there is a no error then click on check transaction data and execute fine either the sender is already settled or there is a nothing to settle fine if you see this type of the message are appearing then meaning of this okay Fourth step is once the accounts team has settled the maintenance order, then you need to 
again open your maintenance order in IW32 and click on this complete business. This is the complete business icon. Fine. Presently, our maintenance order in the takeo stage uh, complete possible with warning. Then you click on the complete. Okay, and save. Then your maintenance order come in the close stage. Fine. CLSD, GMPS, NMAT, PRC, SETC. Hope you understand these points. In case if the MO was wrongly closed, our user wants to do some mode maintenance activity, then the user can cancel the business completion and take off through IW32. You need to open the maintenance order in IW32. Go in the order menu. Go in the function sub menu. Go in the complete sub menu. Click on this cancel business completion. Cancel business completion and save. Once you do this activity, then your uh, maintenance order come in the takeaway stage. Okay, all the maintenance order should be closed except in case of ME AMC MO, as this AMC MO should remain open till the completion of the AMC period. Okay, but partial settlement of the cost KO88 should also be done regularly in case of even AMC maintenance order. Okay. For if the MNC, MC period of any equipments is seven years, then you are not going to suppose to close the maintenance order in the third year. But uh, for, uh, after the completion of the third year payment, you need to settle these payments three years in the subsequent year. Okay. Also, in case of the MO is the temporary advance settlement, TACO should not be done till final settlement of the corresponding temporary advance documents. Fine. The next, any executive public person or any officer must complete their notification MO before transfer of public retirement and due care should be taken by the competent authority in any plan, SSA or public circle in this regard. However, if it is not done by retired public transfer executive, the system allows the closure of roles, those MO by any other person available in the same work center subject to availability of the BM roles. Fine. This is very important points. If any person retire public transfer, the system allows the closure of those MOs by any other person available in the same work center subject to availability of the BM roles. Similarly, in the notification, user status may be set as no code by other person responsible as available in the same work center by putting the per number of public user ID as initiator in the notification. For this, other person responsible should go the partner function at the bottom of the notification screen, select initiator in the first column and put his own per number user ID and save. Then system will allow him to process the no who notification. Fine. For example, for the doing the bulk closure of the notification in the maintenance order, you need to run the transaction code IW28 for notification change and IW38 for the maintenance order change and see the pending list of the required date selection and the maintenance date plan field data. Okay. If the order orders are in the CRDD states, then do release by green flag. If all the orders in the CRTD state, you can do the click on this green flag by selecting. Okay. Then do the technically complete, then cost settlement for actual cost consumption, then business completion CSD for order. Step by step maintenance order process will follow. You have to select the MO with all same status. Okay. This is very important points because once in the release, once in the CRDD, then you cannot do any bulk activity. Fine. Uh, once you select, go in the order, go in the completion, go in the complete technically. Okay. All click on the complete technically. Okay. Uh, then complete orders. Do you want warning in the commitment check? Still save. Okay. 
After getting the status of all the maintenance order in the table, do pause settlement through KO88 oblique KO8G with the help of FICO team. After all the cost settlement done, the list of TECO orders, then in the similar way you have to complete business flag for all the maintenance order. Okay. Okay. The, th these things is very important. While closing the maintenance order, if you got the message save rejected by system then what is the meaning of this check the purchase requisition of the purchase order created for the maintenance order and do carry forward the pr of the purchase requisition or purchase order to the current financial year for example this is the maintenance order and using clicking on this this is the document flow okay see this is the maintenance notification this is the maintenance order this is the purchase requisition this is the purchase order okay and these are the good receipt right check the purchase order me 23n and pr in the me 53n in the commitment document dates if it is previous year then do carry forward of the document through fmj2 using accounts team fine and after this do the takeo activity okay the second error frequently coming while doing cost settlement please check the setting on the settlement rule of the maintenance order should be cost center as shown in the below image okay see uh, click on this uh, uh, three arrow icons here okay this is the settlement rule icon okay you need to uh, fill this uh, settlement receiver like that. This is the electrical division and 100% cost settlement in this uh, maintenance order in this cost center. The settlement receiver will be the cost center of your current business area. So if you not already fill this uh, cost center and settlement receiver, then maybe accounts officer will get the same error. So what we have learned in this SAP tutorial, how and when the close the maintenance order, how can we close the notification, how can we close the maintenance order, how can we settle the maintenance order by single activity or in the bulk activity by accounts team using KO88 and KO80. Right? And the third step, how can we open the wrongly closed maintenance order or notification if you have done this activity for uh, by mistake or if any work has been still pending fourth one is uh, how can we close the how can we close the bulk notification bulk closer of the notification and maintenance order or do any type of the changes in the bulk in the maintenance order or notification okay we have learned okay third while closing the maintenance order if you get the error save rejected by system what you have to follow and while closing uh, while settling the maintenance order if you are getting the message that uh, if do any error related with the settlement then you need to maintain the proper settlement route here and settlement receiver okay so hope you understand uh, all these things if you have any query in your mind then please uh, mention in the comment section and uh, share with your friends and colleagues officers who are working in the plant maintenance activity okay thank you our uh, coating and PM coating for uh, for creating such uh, nice tutorial okay thanks for watching this uh, video tutorial and if you are new in our YouTube channel uh, then please subscribe our YouTube channel for and don't forget to press the bell icon for our latest video updates okay thank you have a nice day. Keep smiling.